Hi, my name is Tracy Collins and I am the CEO and the founder of the National Black Doulas Association. Why reproductive health for me? <laughs> it was a calling that I had to fulfill, just really simple. Um, I had to fulfill this calling and it was a part of my life's work. So after 17 years in the field working one-on-one -on -one with birthing people, I founded the National Black Doulas Association and I wanted to be able to find the black doulas and where were we and how do we help offset these numbers with black women dying in this country four to five times more than our counterparts. So it was really important for me to create a safe space, you know, for us, by us, that empowered us with the right content and information and education, you know, to provide longevity and sustainability, but also to help change the narrative in this country and to rightfully take back what was ours and to tell our own stories. It was really important for me to do it in that way. I was never meant to be a leader. For me, in my eyes, I never thought I was going to be a leader in this industry. It was not what I was seeking out to be and do. Um, but I, I, I'm i grateful for the platform and for the level of success that we have attained in such a short amount of time. And women need to lead in reproductive health because we know our stories, we know our journeys, we know our experiences. We have not only the education to back that up, but we also personally walk it. I don't ever believe that politics belong in wombs or in uteruses and um, in birthing bodies, in reproductive health. And so that's why it's important for women to take charge. It's important for women to, to lead, but more importantly, because black women are dying at the rate we are in this country when it comes to birth and immediate postpartum uh, trauma, we, we, it's imperative that we, that we leave. So that's my story. Thanks.